Hi, Sirius Bruce here, back on their Anthro Adventures New Game Plus 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 video, episode 208. Yes, we're 100 away from 308, if we're ever going to get there. And, yeah, I've, I've done some Bosonic Lab grinding, and this, I think, is where the speed is going to increase enough that it will be interesting to watch. So, you can see this is all 3, I can get this all the way up to 1640. Which gets 94 times speed to 436,000 times speed. Not only that, I can speed up the production use of antipreons. But before I do that, actually, I, I want to get more of this because I should be getting 1750 runes per second, but I'm getting less. So now I'm going to um, use this upgrade, this going from 271 times to 1600 times. This is huge. I have trillions of Z-Bosons. Okay, that's actually disappointingly slow, but at least, th yeah, this is going to be way faster than before, which means that I'll just be able to get a lot more runes. Like, I'm already getting a lot of runes, and this is just going to be even faster once I start doing this, especially if I, like, I should probably also increase my overdrive to, like, okay, not, not too fast, but, like, this. This will help speed things up further. I can go into Big Rip at... Definitely been a while. Yeah, 115. Okay, I thought I was going to get more rewards than that, but it's it's at least something. And I'll, I guess I'll grind in Big Rip a little bit while I go here, so I can just convert W- minus back to W+, plus and um, I'll just do this, gain Space Shards, because I don't think I have the upgrade that I can get. I don't have this upgrade. Yeah, I'm very. That's the one I am very close to. I'm also decently close to this one. Actually, no, I'm even closer to the this one because the one where I need only one Go Sleep Sonic Rune. I'm I'm really close to that one, and that that one's a big lifesaver. So you can see now it's really only going to take like 30 seconds. I guess I can even increase my overdrive speed because I don't want to wait for this. And hopefully this will actually be good enough that, I mean, this makes the Nana Field Rewards 99.8% stronger, which I think is pretty good. <laughs> I'm just imagining if it was like making a soft kick 99.8% weaker or something like that. That would be so OP, but no. Anyway, um, boom. We've gotten the one Go Sleep Sonic Rune I need, and now I can get this upgrade, which... Yeah, and it's one of the better upgrades, and which is, yeah, that that's why I wanted to get it. Probably also want to get some Quantum Bosonic Runes, just so I can um, start, like, getting, like, um, so I can start getting more levels of this. Because this really isn't all that many levels. Um, I'm not really sure what I should be, I guess I can oscillate the Z-Bos. Yeah, that's probably a good idea, considering how powerful that's going to be now. Um, I can't really get that many levels of either this or that. I guess I'll just go into Big Rip just because of how m much more powerful I am with that one upgrade. It's only 119 re rewards, but it does get me an extra radioactive decay. So I guess I guess that's good. And yeah, I, I, I could try to go for the these upgrades, but it still would take a while. I'm probably just going to grind a little bit off camera, and I'll be back when I can get at the very least, these two upgrades, if not this one as well. So, yeah, seen a bit. Okay, so it's been a couple days, and I have grinded way too many runes because I can get not, not yeah, you can see how many upgrades I can get. One, two, three, four, five, six upgrades, all in one. You can just see my postonic antimatter and my antimatter increase like crazy. I'm, I'm getting, or I'm already getting close to my max antimatter, and not only that. I can also, well, you know, I, I can do this. I can oscillate the Z-Bos, and you can see how much faster that is. And this is before upgrading all of these. And, yeah, I'm just going to do it. I'm going to do this. This is going to make it even faster. We're going from quadrillions to septillions, essentially. Not only that, I can do this. And, yeah, I can just see how much better this is already. And I haven't even done everything yet, because... Now what I can do is this. You can see I have 2.5 quadrillion. I am I have instantly gone up two 
orders of magnitude. This is going to allow me to just get so to get way more runes per second. And I, unfortunately, I do need to upgrade this if I really want to get more runes. But I, I'm already back up to the max, and I think yeah, I, I gotta do this if I want to get any more. And I'm already kind of close to the next upgrade, which I have gotten in previous runs. So. Yes, it's just pretty exciting just to do that. And I could also increase my Bosonic Overdrive to not up to max, but I can do it up like pretty high, like 2.6. And this will just this will make it even faster. And I'll go into Big Whip now just to um, get rewards and um, go into Tree of Decay. 18 radioactive decays. And I don't think I need to do anything else. Just go out and hopefully. I'm gonna get even more antimatter. E610, E615, around E617 quadrillion antimatter. That's where I stand. And now with all the W bosons, I can oscillate the Z boson again and start upgrading this. I, I still unfortunately need to be like need to get this back up to the yeah right here. Up, up to like this number, but it's it's not that bad. Now what I can do if I want, I could get some levels of this. I probably just want to get like individual levels because that will be a little boost to both on cancer provider by like doing do nothing here. It's, it's a, yeah, it costs nothing and it gives me a decent boost. And I think I'm just going to be, I can now grind more of this. It's again very fast because of all the Z bosons I've grinded. And I think after this, I'm just going to do a bunch off camera because it's getting slower and I need to grind to the next upgrade here. So yeah, see in a bit. Okay, I'm back and you can see I have enough runes and balsonic antimatter to get not only this upgrade, which I have gotten before, but also this upgrade. Green power effect boosts the tree upgrades. So... You can see it's these upgrades. This hopefully should allow me to get another radioactive decay and just a bunch of of good stuff. So yeah, let's just get this and look at the M10 quadrillion orders of magnitude of Antimatter about. I think this is gonna be better, even better once I get into Big Rip, because E to 92 billion in Big Rip. That's that's definitely a record. And any new rewards? Yes, yeah, six new rewards. And how many radioactive decays? 19. Just ba just barely 19 radioactive decays. So this actually allows me to... I don't know. It, actually, it's, it's not all that powerful, but it's at least something. I think more powerful is this. I can get increase this by 100 times, and then also increase this by um, 50 times. This allows me to... Um, I'm right, currently oscillating the Z boson. So, I think, yeah, this is going to be way faster just to get these bosons. And I can probably even, like, increase the production. Yeah, I, I can do this. Can I go all the way? Okay, I can't go all the way, but I, I can do, like, three times, and that works. Which is kind of crazy. I can probably probably should be, actually, no, I, I don't need to be grinding Infinity Boson runes right now because I'm barely getting any runes at all. Um, maybe I can go big rip again. I will check photons. Um, no, I need 72 ultraviolet light. I'm at 70. So I don't... doesn't look like I'm going to get that many, that much more light empowerments. I could try to dump the rest of my um, quantum bosonic runes into here. Actually, I'm going to do that. I know this is a kind of stupid, but at least it's like a five times increase in my bosonic antimatter. That's at least something. And I'll, I'll get this down to like 2.6. And then I'll go back into Big Rip just to see if I can... Yeah, another billion orders of magnitude of antimatter in Big Rip. Um, no new rewards. Maybe a little farther in Tree of Decay. Yeah, I can see about five additional orders of magnitude of, um, of spins. And actually, this upgrade... Yeah, I can just get that. Which makes me... I just want to see how much... Dial at a time. I have E3500 dial at a time and almost E666 tachyon particles. If I wanted, I could ghostify, but I don't think it's worth it at this point to ghostify. I think 
I think the better solution is to just try to try to push all the way to um, the E60 bosonic antimatter, and then a little more. I don't think I'm going to be able to get E65 bosonic antimatter at this point. I'm going to want at least three Higgs bosons. Well, I think I I kind of have a roadmap for what's going to happen in the in like the near future, and and I'll, I'll do I'll. I'll say this while I'm maxing this enchant so I can I can get this up to that. So the roadmap is I'm gonna do a Higgs reset at, at least three more Higgs bosons. Hopefully more than three. And then after that I know there's like a huge wall at this point around E70 bosonic antimatter. And this is when I um use an exploit that I have not used before. And that this exploit, definitely not intended, but I wouldn't consider it like a glitch or anything because it's not like breaking the rules of the game. It's like, it's it's completely, it it's involves electrons and involves the same line though. I'll just say that. And I think using the exploit, at least before I hit the wall, is kind of cheaty. Because I don't think you... Like, it's definitely not intended. At least at this point. But once I hit the wall... Well, I can't even get this upgrade after the wall. Unless I use the exploit. And also this exploit will help me... Get all the way to a quint E quintillion antimatter. So... Yeah, I can just see where I am here. If I want, I can just... Put a few in into this. Just to see where I am. Um, this will... Make it so I, I, um, like if I use this, I don't need to get as much bosonic answer. I'm, and instead of being, um, instead of being five orders of magnitude away, I'm two orders of magnitude away. That, that'll be big if I want to actually get three Higgs bosons. I mean, it won't be very big now. I, I mean, if I want, I could also just get a whole bunch of levels of this. It's actually 147 times. That's actually not bad if I did want to get bosonic antimatter, or not bosonic antimatter, but um, bosonic battery. This seems weaker than it should be, though. It's like, if this is 147 times, um, like, I'm, it's still going down if I'm, if I'm completely maxing the bosonic battery, which, which makes no sense. Yeah, I'll, I'll just, I'll, I'll swap this for that, and, I mean, if I, if I wanted, I could, like, try to cleverly use... I, I could... It's not clever, but, like, swap this for that to gain even more bosonic battery. Because even when I'm not doing it like this, I'm still gaining, like, the same amount of bosonic battery. I think this is at 1.6 million before. Now it's at 1.2 million. And this may... Actually, that may just be due to because... Maybe because of my bosonic overdrive rather than anything else. Like... Okay, it is slightly more, but it's definitely not 147 times more. That, I would consider a bug, because I don't see why. I mean, no, that, that that's not it. It's, it's, it's not like it's it doesn't stack with this, because even if it like did not stack with Bosonic Watts, and Bosonic Labs is currently running, like it would just add to it, it would still, like, over double my bosonic battery gain. I mean, it's still something I can do, but it's just not as useful as I may think it should be. Or as it should be. Not as I may think it should be. It's as it should. So actually, I can gain a whole bunch of levels of this, and then I'm also just going to gain a bunch of levels of that. It's not really going to do all that much. It's, I, not, it's not even that exciting. It's really just the same thing over and over again. And I think I'm just going to do a lot of off-camera grinding until I reach the point where I think, or at least I can, I seriously consider doing another Higgs reset. And that will be next episode. So, yeah, hope you enjoyed. Peace out. Mm -hmm.